IU health officials now say nearly 200 employees will leave the company in protest of a requirement to get a flu shot. An IU expert says the move seems to conflict with a nearly 50-year-old law. Eight IU Health employees recently lost their jobs for refusing to get an influenza vaccination, even though some of them filed paperwork seeking an exemption on religious or other grounds. IU Kelly School of Business professor Jamie Prinkert says the Civil Rights Act dictates employers should accommodate beliefs or give an exception from a policy unless the exception would cause a burden on an employer. It covers uh, discrimination on the basis of religion. And so not, not only does Title VII say it's unlawful for an employer that is covered by Title VII to discriminate against someone because they are a particular um, religion or, or faith. Monroe County Health Department Administrator Penny Caudill says the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommend everyone who's at least six months old be vaccinated each year to maintain public health. So recommend it for all U.S. health care workers. Um, to be vaccinated annually. And part of that concern is not just to keep us safe, but to also not spread infection to someone who may be at high risk. In a release, spokeswoman Whitney Ertle says IU Health expects to lose approximately 175 employees who refuse the flu vaccine.